what is going on people you saw the title how i spent five thousand dollars to illustrate how i was losing millions it was kind of crazy um I, as of today i am shutting down b school for hustlers to new new applicants you uh, I need to go ahead and change all these prices and everything but um, essentially what's gonna happen if you are a member of the corporate toolbox you're gonna love this you're gonna love this um, I was running ads and I was doing really well with creating that and I got a webinar that 71% of the people who signed up watched the whole webinar, but they weren't buying. They weren't buying. And I, you know, I was sick and I was thinking and I was thinking and I was pondering and I was pondering and I was pondering and it hit me. It was because one of the things, um, you know, you're going to talk, we're going to talk about this is running ads, your creative, which is your ad and your webinar, which is your, warming up piece because the ad is to turn cold traffic to warm traffic and the webinar is to turn warm traffic to hot traffic where they actually click the purchase and um i was just sitting here and i was just going through my whole process because you know essentially you know you will be taught this if you're in b school for hustlers currently if you signed up for the original corporate toolbox you're going to get all of this new training you're not going to have to do anything what i'm going to do is put this new training here in b school for hustlers so you won't have to get a new password and log into you, you won't have to do none of that for everyone who bought the original corporate toolbox you you are gucci as they say in these internet streets you're good to go you're going to get all this training and i'm going to show you a breakdown of what i've learned because you know i've created like eight different ads i created like six different webinars so i was working out the process and it hit me that the offer was weak the offer wasn't good and one of the things is when you're operating with warm to hot traffic it allows you to make mistakes and it allows you not to put together because when you're spending money, you pay attention to where you're spending money. You pay attention to your ads. You pay attention to your conversion rate. And, you know, so this was built with warm traffic and this was built with warm traffic. I didn't use any paid traffic for either one of these. And um, as I was, you know, recovering uh, tomorrow, we start with the training tomorrow night at 7 p.m. I was thinking, I was like, what, what's the problem? What's the problem? And as I clicked on this and I went into it and I realized the YouTube wealth package, it wasn't a good offer. The YouTube money, how to market and sell on YouTube, credit mastery. Someone who's interested in starting a YouTube channel could care less about credit mastery how to create and sell online courses for profit, potentially the, the money management course. Um, I'm getting ready to redo that for Savage Finance. Um, a lot of people, money management is really, really important. And I feel that everyone should get this course and they should go through it, but it ain't working. And this is, you know, I have a good friend who was like, you know, when you're running tests and paid advertising, you're buying data. That's what you're doing. And the data is indicating that that ain't working. Wealth habits ain't working. How to set up a YouTube business and make money. That ain't working. So once again, I've went into the lab. So this is what we're going to get into. Uh, the YouTube super creative, how to make money with YouTube in all aspects. So I literally tore everything down and I'm redoing it. This bundles includes how to run ads for fun and profit, how to build your YouTube channel or influence the YouTube creative, how to create digital products for fun and profit, how to set up your YouTube business, corporate structure and templates, 
in how to make YouTube ads. This is how to run YouTube ads. This is how to make YouTube ads. Cause I uh, got into a mastermind and they were looking at my ads. I was like, man, these ads are really dope. So the ads were working the ads, you know, I'm a YouTuber. I've been a YouTuber for 12 years. I know how to create ads, but in the webinar was working, but the offer was weak. And you know, this is something I figured out before I even talked to other people. And they were like, yeah, the offer, you know, it's not exciting and the creative mind. So they're going to go to this offer, which will be a hundred percent YouTube related. I got to create a freebie. I got to create something that's related to this because I was giving the money management course away and that just wasn't hidden, wasn't hidden at all. And it got me to thinking, all right, if I got this problem with this YouTube and once I start running paid traffic for the corporate toolbox, I'm going to run into the same problem. And I was like, oh, so introducing the corporate citizen. Now, this is totally different. Um, this is the package that I'm putting together starting tomorrow. The business credit accelerator, how to ramp up your business credit, why you need to start an LLC, not a C Corp, how to start a business from scratch, the framework, um, the art of holding, how to create your own conglomerate and bank. That's the bundle. Why you need to start an LLC, how to start a business from scratch, the framework, how to sell online and off, the art of closing the deal, how to brand the business, the art of communicating with customers, how to scale your company, set it up for growth and profits, the danger of age corporations. People tell you, you can get business credit easy, what you can do to make your customer happy, uh, money management for corporate citizens, how to play the game. So I'm going to um, do a money management for corporate citizens and I'm going to do a money management for civilians, you know, and because essentially I was going to run into the same problem with B school for hustlers because the offer, you know, when, when I'm creating YouTube and videos and people watch the channel, they subscribe to the channel, they like the channel, they watch 30, 40 videos. They become real warm traffic. So when you're dealing with warm, warm traffic, you can make mistakes and miscalculations that you just cannot do with paid traffic. So this is why I've made the decision to shut down B school for hustlers, probably going to shut down hustlers, Kung Fu university. And I'm going to go with this because when you're putting together your training, it has to make sense. It has to be congruent. So this is what's going on. <clears throat> so uh, essentially with this, I have the ability. So this is, let's see. This is the YouTube creative. I got that going and essentially another thing for those of you who care about running traffic, if you offer a payment plan, they're going to take that payment plan. So I've got two versions of this and this is super easy to set up because I'm going to teach you how to create digital products for fun and profit. I've learned a lot about creating online courses and products. I learned what to do, what not to do, how to set them up, how to make them better. So I'm going to teach that how to build a YouTube channel of influence. Do you know you can start a YouTube channel with 3000 subscribers and make 10 to 15,000 a month. Mm -hmm. I've done it. I've done it more than once. I've done it actually Disruptive mail, first version up to 15, 17,000, second version. And I'm not really pushing anything over there right now. I'm just putting out content, but this is what we're going to be talking about and how to run YouTube ads for fun and profit, how to make YouTube ads for fun and profit, the creative mind, of course, and creativity. So this is going to be 
hands down a much better offer than what I was doing, you know, because like I said, I've been thinking about my business and I've been focusing on my business and focusing on what I do and focusing on this. And, you know, I feel that this is just going to be a better result once I start running ads because I've literally stopped running ads and I got to spend some time building up the first section of this, how to set up your YouTube business. That's going to be the first section. And then we're going to go to the second section, how to build a YouTube channel of influence. Then we're going to go to the third section, how to create digital products for fun and profit. And, you know, we're going to get into these probably congruently, congruently. We'll be talking about that because there, there's a lot of training that will go into that because uh, I was having a conversation with a good friend and we were talking about the number of ads that are being run on YouTube. And I'm getting really good because um, what I'm one of the things I'm doing with my research is I'm signing up for offers. I'm listening to their webinars. I'm checking out everything. And there's a lot of stuff out there that just I, I know it ain't converting and it's not, they're not going to see these ads for long. So we're going to get into all of that. And then with the, the corporate toolbox, all of this is business related. Uh, I might add something more to this uh, essentially. But all this is business related and we're going to go how to set up your parent company then create child companies, how to set up your corporate banking, how to start setting up business credit, and we're going to how to start a business from scratch, how to sell online and off, the art of closing the deal. All of this stuff makes sense. All of this stuff works. And, you know, we start this tomorrow with the art of holding because essentially the art of holding how to create your own conglomerate and bank. And that's what I've done. Like I've, I have created a situation where I was able to loan money from one company to another company. And, you know, we, we will get into that. We will get into a lot of the upper echelon of creating businesses, creating parent companies. And for all of you folks who got into the original corporate toolbox and for some reason, um, your your credit card was compromised and you had to get a new credit card this is your chance to get back in and because essentially let's have this conversation and this is one of the reasons that I'm going to do um, the money management for corporate citizens literally <clears throat> I got like 40 credit cards right and 39 of them don't have anything on them so this is part of your money management and segmentation if you sign up for the art of holding, you should sign up with a credit card. You ain't using for nothing else. So you will know you Gucci as they like to say in these internet streets. Um, one of the things that I have gotten away from since I've cleaned up my corporate act is I have one personal credit card that I use for personal stuff like getting food and stuff. And then for all of my corporate charges, I have three, uh, corporate credit cards and then right now the thing I'm using the most is the Wells Fargo credit card because the Divi charge card is like American Express and you know uh, I use the Divi for a few things just to get it you know active so it will report and um, we're going to talk about money management <clears throat> a little different like I said I'm going to do a completely different course uh, I figure it's going to take me about three months to get all this done. So this is your chance to get into the art of holding now and establish yourself. Because essentially, um, I have a lot of people, I, I get emails every day. It's like this happened. Like, you know, we're, we're going to get into money management for corporate citizens. It's going to be really, really deep because it's going to talk about what I am doing. Like I got 40 credit cards and only use one. I, my utilization on my other 39 credit cards is zero. And it's going to stay that way because money centers, where money comes from, keeping your books. Like right now, when I look at my books, it's real easy because everything is properly segmented. And I'm not trying to do everything out of one checking account. 
I'm not trying to do everything out of one credit card and each thing has a specific person. And you know, when we get into the building of business credit, we're going to talk about how you can use your personal credit, get that really clean and use that to build your business credit. Uh, that's going to be what that course is about. So there's a whole bunch of stuff that's about to go down. Like I said, I am pretty much thinking about shutting down Hustlers Kung Fu University. And, you know, like I said, B-School, I'm just going to go in and jack the prices up to twenty, thirty thousand dollars So no one's going to sign up for that. And for all of the people who are there, you're going to get the new art of holding. And you're also going to get the YouTube super creative. Now, if you're new and you want both, there will probably be some kind of deal in the future, but it's, it's not going to be on a payment plan. It's not going to be on a payment plan. So this is what's happening in 2021. You know, I remember last year when this whole pandemic thing started and I, I went to work. And here we go again. I'm going to work because uh, I like this plan, you know, and it, it's easier. It's cleaner. The graphics look better. It's a smoother layout. And it makes sense because when you are interrupted on YouTube by an ad and you're like disruptive and then it's like, OK, well, I'll give this a shot. The payoff has got to be good. The payoff has got to be great and that wasn't happening with um b school for hustlers like you know i'm getting rid of some of this stuff i'm rearranging this stuff and you don't have to email me or ask you know once i do it i will send a message through the b school for hustlers um messaging center and i got a community page and you will get all of the new webinars. You will get new, all of the new training, the new, you know, you're going to get it all. You're going to get, you're going to get the YouTube stuff and you're going to get the new corporate citizen stuff. And what I'm going to do is start off with this one. Cause I'm probably going to be, you know, be doing a lot of training. I'm going to start off with the art of holding, how to create your own conglomerate and bank. And I'm going to start off with how to set up your parent company and then create child companies. That's going to be the very first thing that we're going to do. So once again, um, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and put links below. If you want to sign up, it is 1800 and what did I do? It's 1800 or 24 times 150. So you can get back in. Um, it's, it's going to be a little different. We're going to have the, tr the training Tuesdays and Thursdays. We're going to have the live training. So we're going to do that and we're going to keep doing that. And this is just going to be a better presentation. It's going to be more organized and it's going to be Gucci. Like I said, it's going to be totally, totally different than B school for hustlers because uh, frankly, B school for hustlers, the corporate toolbox, it like that section was getting, let's see, that section was getting to be, this is getting huge. This is getting huge. Now I will be transferring some of this like how to talk to your cpa that's going to be transferred to the new thing uh the articles of organization template that's going to be transferred and some of this stuff i'm going to be able to transfer and some of it i'm you know it just depends because i'm gonna like like i said i'm leaving all these webinars where they are because it this it's it's a ton of webinars so I, I need to think about how I'm going to set that up in the um, new platform, you know, and so we will get more into that. We will get in, you know, some of this stuff is probably going to be transferred over plus, you know, I got to go through all of this. I mean, like I said, it's, it's going to take me a minute <laughs> to go through all this, but this is 
this is huge. This is a lot of training and I, I think I need to do a better job of organizing it and I'm pretty much going to get rid of this. Teach you to make money. That's going to go away. And that's probably going to go away. So 17 and 15. It's probably going to go away. Uh, 16, I'm going to keep that inclusive. So once again, this is your chance to, you know, if you want to um, get into it. And also, let's see. Let's go YouTube Creative. All right. So let me kind of go back. All right. Here we go. So this is the link yeah this is the one that i am going to give you guys a link to because this one has a payment plan so yeah i'm gonna be there's gonna be a link to that so essentially what this is going to do is teach you how to do exactly what i'm doing this is what i do every day this this is what i do this is how i do it and you know tuesday and thursday that will be the time for you to come in and ask any questions that you may have i am pretty much going to reserve the one-on-one -on -one consults and the coaching like you know uh there were people who signed up for the old corporate toolbox i'm going to keep those agreements but it's going to be a it's going to be a grip to talk to me and i'm going to tell you why it Doing the one on one co coaching because uh, I had someone who paid me like 10,000 and we, we had to talk this weekend. And essentially, I would prefer the group coaching because it's way more efficient than the one on one stuff. I might create some type of mastermind, some type of business mastermind once I get enough people who are actually doing some stuff. But you know. Uh, I'm not going to offer the consults because it's just, it's just so disruptive, you know, and the fact that I've been sick for the last two weeks and I got behind and I got, I mean, the next three months are going to be a beast. They're going to be a beast because we're going to be creating content. And then I've got these, um, interviews set up. And like I said, you know what, how do you, uh, put an elephant in the refrigerator? You have to break it up into pieces. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to break it up into pieces. We're going to do a little bit each day like this week. This is the first week that I felt normal in like two weeks. And um, yeah, this is what we're going to do. So B school for hustlers is a wrap. It's a wrap. If you're at B school for hustlers, you're going to get all of this new training, uh, the new art of holding. You're going to get all of that. You don't have to do anything nothing uh i was just gonna put it there and i'm going to uh, make it very unattractive for anyone else to sign up for it because this is what i learned spending five thousand dollars testing ads and you know i feel that once i get um some of this stuff because i'm going to i have a new ideal for an ad that i want to make uh because i finally got everything that i needed so i'm going to work on that and it's funny i crashed the drone again i did not lose the drone but i crashed it but i got insurance on it so i can just send it in and they're going to send me another one so i'm waiting on that and yeah it, it's it's a lot that's going on it's a lot that's going on and this is what's going to happen so the links should be below and we get started on this this week we get started on this this week we jump into it and um, there's going to be a better presentation and we're going to get into some deeper issues because essentially I feel uh, you know for those of you who want to create online courses like I'm going to show you something 
this right here was a mistake when people come to hustlers kung fu they get lost there's just too, there's just too much here and i was starting to do that with b school but uh, you know i didn't get carried away but it was starting to happen with b school and i you know it's like I'm, I'm nipping that in the bud but if you're creating online courses you don't want to create a whole bunch of them uh it gets confusing uh and once again this is one of the reasons that i am um pulling the plug on b school to new to new people and then just creating these new platforms which are already set up in a better presentation so this is what i do when i'm sick i sit down i think and 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 i keep thinking and you know so apparently i just ripped my business apart and i was ruthless with it and it just designated because essentially as my friend said what we were doing we were buying data the ad worked the webinar worked the offer didn't work so this is you know and honestly i kind of like this new theme you know it's just like I said, it's better, you know, I spent some time uh, putting this together and it's just a, a better theme, in my opinion, for this. Because, you know, and become a corporate citizen dot com. And I feel that the school, the ad, the creative economy, the ad creative academy, you know, I just really like how this this looks I mean boom you know you, you come here and you see the big YouTube button and it's like I'm here for YouTube and you know th that that was one of the issues I had with this because this was a more of a corporate thing and so I got a different um, presentation a different game plan a different way of doing this and like uh, you know this was created hustlers kung fu life skills was created 2015 and it's six years old so i learned a lot from this and you know essentially would think if, if once you get some people who signed up and pay for it you can't delete courses so it's really a crowded da database and it's just a lot of stuff that i have learned in time and we're going to do a lot because I'm getting ready to work on my videos, make them a little bit better. Um, and yeah, shut this puppy down. And like I said, redo the money management course that needs to be done. Like I said, um, lots going on here. Lot is going on here. So if you missed out on the first time, because essentially, I am going to raise the price of this, but right now there's nothing there. So this is the time to get in. This is the time to make your move. This is the time because um, tomorrow, 7 p.m., there's going to be a live training. And Thursday at 3 p.m., there's going to be another live training. I'm going to keep those days because one of the things I've learned is when I keep moving stuff around, people get confused. And I've had some really nice attendance to the Tuesday show and the Thursday show. So I'm going to keep those days because it's like, okay. And this allows people to plan. It's like, okay, well, we're going to do this. And, you know, I haven't done it for the last two weeks because I've been sick. But, you know, we're about to get back on track. And I think that you guys are really going to love the new training and the new presentation. And, you know... It makes sense when I say the corporate citizen, you go to the site, it's the corporate citizen. And when I say YouTube, the YouTube super creative, how to make money with YouTube in all aspects, how to build a YouTube channel of influence. This is what I have done. This is what I do. How to create digital products for fun. This is what I do. How to create. This is what I do. 
I've just started making ads and I'm going to teach you guys how to run ads in the creative mind, of course, on creativity. And there might be one or two more courses that will come to each platform. But I learned from when I put B school for hustlers together and I, you know, actually I did an okay job of planning, but I didn't do the, like this stuff right here. You, this right here, I, I, I feel that this is going to win. And it's actually going to help people because uh, I'm, I'm thinking about setting up my new ad, which today's a sunny day, but I got so much stuff to do. But uh, I want to do it on a sunny day. I, I've got my wardrobe picked out. I'm working on my script and all this other stuff. So I got some other items I want to put in this um, presentation so i'm going to work on that and then i'm going to start running ads again probably the beginning of march and you know you will see them because i run them on your favorite youtube channels and you know we will see because i got one ad creative that performs pretty well but i would have to tweak it and then i want to make another one that's going to be a little bit more pow in your face so we're going to do that and I've committed myself to make ads for the rest of the year. So there's going to be a lot of training in how to make YouTube ads for fun and profit and how to run YouTube ads for fun and profit. And that's a play off of the Craigslist book, how to make use Craigslist for fun and profit. My sec, my second best selling book. So this is what we're getting ready to go into. So like the price is going to go up. I'm just saying, and don't be sending me emails when the price is going to go up because the sooner you sign up, the sooner you can start learning. The sooner it's the beginning of the year. This is the time to establish your holding company. This is the time to establish your operating company. This is time to get your corporate banking together. And let's talk about business credit. There are many, many folks out here who are talking about you can get business credit super easy and if you have a fico score of 720 in a job you can create an llc get an ein create your corporate banking and you can get american express chase and all of these other business credit cards but they're going to come with a personal guarantee and depending upon your income the limits are not going to be that big and this is one of the things like uh, there are many videos talking about, you know, how to develop business credit. I saw a video where someone was talking about they developed millions of dollars in business credit within two years. And I would really like to see their income statements because here's the thing. In this new environment, no one's going to extend you a lot of business credit. You might be able to get a little bit of business credit. You might be able to get the American Express business platinum card, but I guarantee you they're going to cap you at 10K. I guarantee it. Because without income statements, without banking statements, um, these things are important. And a lot of people are just like, you could do it, you could do it. And I understand that the what I call the feel good YouTubers. Oh man, yeah, you go ahead and you get this business credit card with $50,000. And you know what? I didn't get my first $50,000 credit card limit until I showed income of 250. That's when I got my first $50,000 credit card. And I, I'm just sitting here and I'm like, all right, all right, all right. So we're going to talk about how to develop business credit from scratch from, you know, and within a year, which to me is pretty quick. Uh, back in the good old days, it still took you six months to a year to create your LLC, to get your EIN and the, you know, create your Paydex with Granger, Uline, Staples. And this is something else. I don't see that a lot of people talk about Staples, but Staples will had a product where they gave you a credit card and they report it to, um, Dun and Bradstreet. But no one um no one actually talks about staples i don't know i haven't done the research but i'm going to give you because as someone who has 
three business credit cards um well one business credit card and two business charge cards we're going to talk about that process and the things that you need to do to get your business credit going because like all right i got emails and emails people like hey do you know do you teach how to do business credit all right y'all need to slow down like you are not going to do this in a few weeks okay you're not going to do this in a few weeks it's going to take a year is good a year is good all right so i want to properly set expectations because some of y'all are so gassed up on these youtubers who are telling you that you can do this in a few weeks that you can get like six figures of business credit and don't you know there was one guy was like you don't even have to show no income and they just i'm like i know that fundamentally is untrue they're going to look for your income they're going to look at your business checking account revenue like when i got my edl loan guess what they asked for bank statements you know so this whole notion that you can have trash personal credit and then go out here and build six figure seven figure business credit uh for the most people it ain't true now, if you got trash personal credit and you got a business that does 1.5 or 2 million a year, you can get yourself some robust business credit lines based upon your revenue. But once again, we have so many people who are trying to put the cart before the horse. They're trying to get the business credit. They don't have no revenue. I'm like, come on, people. We got to do this right. Because one of the things that I do here at Hustlers Kung Fu and that I do at Savage Finance I'm never going to tell you anything that's going to make you lose money. I'm never going to tell you anything that's going to get you in trouble. And I'm never going to tell you anything that's going to financially harm you. That's my promise to you. I don't do this. This is one of the reasons. And like all these crypto people, uh, I had another one who was like, he gave me a, you know, I'm up 50%. I'm up 50 times, like 50 times what? How much money, player? And I just like left it alone because, you know, as the Hodge twins used to say, you're going to do what you want to do. And, you know, I'm going to leave it alone. You know, if you want to invest in cryptocurrency versus starting a business that throws off cash each and every month, that's your decision. Good luck with it. I wish you the best. Leave me out of the conversation. Leave me out of it. Because um, I have a feeling that this is going to end up badly for many people. But time will tell. Time will tell. And... You know, I'm going to focus on the personal finance side of my business and I'm going to focus on the business side of my business. And I'm going to be very focused and I'm going to get away from these distractions. And this is why I decided to shut B School for Hustlers down. And this is why I decided to launch these two new platforms. Focus on my business, work on my business, do what I need to do for my business help people, educate people, train people. That's what I want to do. Uh, I'm, I'm out of the, like, you know, I have a new policy. I had a few yard birds leave some comments, delete and block. I was deleting and blocking like a Kung Fu master this morning. Delete, block, delete, block. They didn't respond to these clowns because here's the thing. Uh, a lot of folks know that I'm successful and that's a problem for a lot of weak-minded jealous-minded hateful people it's like you know like yeah 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 you make all this money man but you ain't no millionaire blah 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 oh you're doing all this but the minute you get old duh, duh, just wishing disaster and calamity on me because they don't have it and those folks will be blocked and deleted and we're gonna keep it moving I'm not getting into these pointless, stupid conversations with people who, for the most part, as one of my <laughs> fans said, more than likely this dude's living in his mama's basement. So that's the new policy. So we're going to uh, level up. We're going to talk about it. And with business credit, you got to be careful with business credit. You know, a lot of people like you, you go out and get this house with business credit. You know, um, my Wells Fargo card, I actually got a statement because I didn't pay it yet. And it's got $7,000 on it. And the minimum payment is one fifty-three. 
So if I was to max this bad boy out, my minimum payment would be 500 bucks for 25,000, 500 bucks. That'd be the minimum payment. And when you're talking about a hundred thousand dollars worth of credit cards and you max out a hundred G's, your minimum payment's going to be a G a month, a G a month. And you know, people are, um, not really aware or really thinking about that when you use these business credit products, there's a cost It's called a carrying cost. And this is why at the moment there's virtually nothing on my Divi uh, charge card because Divi I'm set up where I pay them every week. Like, you know, so that's, I'm using the Wells Fargo more than I'm using the Divi. And this is part of the money segmentation of what I'm doing. So that's it. Links are below for the folks who want to get on board. And once again, segment your money. You know, you should have a credit card that you're not using that you can use for this. Hopefully it's a rewards card and you should use that and you should, you know, we got to get away from these debit cards because uh, I've had a lot of people who had their debits cards compromised and I'm like, you need to be financially abundant. You need to have multiple credit cards. Like someone asked me, what's the point in having 40 credit cards? Cause I'm playing the game, 40 credit cards, use them, barely use them. And this is something I'm going to cover in the corporate citizen money management course, because all of my spend is now moving toward my business credit cards. Um, I just have personal credit for, for fun. I mean, it's not essential in my life. I, I really, I mean, here, here's the truth. I really don't use my credit. And I want you to be in the position where you have enough cash flow where you can use credit for convenience versus an extension of your lifestyle, which is what many people are doing. And this is how things turn bad on you at some point. So we're going to get into that and we're going to get into the layout. And there, there's, like I said, there's going to be a whole bunch of new training. Um, there's going to be a lot of stuff that we need to do. And this is it. So, the price, this is the end of February. So the price isn't going to go up until at least the end of March. So you got five weeks and don't be emailing me. Hey, Glenn, when the price go go up? That, 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 that's just, just annoying. It's like, look, man, you need to go ahead and get this thing started. Uh, you're starting a business. You're starting your banking. You're starting your conglomerate. It's going to take time, people. It's going to take time. I mean, I'm amazed at how many of you have went to college for four years with no guarantee of any job or anything, but you get on me and you want to see results in the mere weeks. And what you can do in a year can be amazing. And what you can do in five years can be staggering. It could be literally be staggering. And this is one of the things I'm starting to move away from because I did a video, you know, most of the stuff on YouTube that does really well is teaching people how to hustle. And I had a hustle. And when I got sick, I couldn't hustle no more. And my hustle shut down. And the difference between having a hustle in a business is the second time I got sick and did not work for five months, my business did not shut down. My business still made money. So I'm going to focus more on us building businesses, setting up systems and processes and hiring people and getting that stuff going than the hustling. Uh, the hustle, the hustle thing is okay. But at the end of the day, we all want to be business owners. We all want to create businesses that, um, we can do things with that we can grow and we can build these assets and we can get this money. So this is what's going on. So the links should be below. And you know, since you're warm traffic, you have access to the payment plan. When I start running ads, 
I'm not going to have access to their payment plan and I'm going to see how that goes. So you can get on the payment plan. And like I said, if you missed out on last time, this is, this is your chance to get in. This is your chance. Like I said, uh, the price is probably going to go up March in the March. And then, cause at that point I should have a lot of stuff there. And right now this is your opportunity to get in and make it do what it do. So the links are below. Welcome to the corporate citizen. Welcome to the YouTube super creative, how to make money with YouTube and all aspects. I'm, I'm going to put my foot off in this because, uh, in my mastermind, I have been tapped to teach some stuff to some people with millions of subscribers that they don't know. So I can teach you how to have a small channel, hook it up with an online platform and you know let's just keep it conservative because you know these people talking about you're going to make you know 30 40 50 thousand Let, let's just keep it a buck you keep your job you start a youtube channel you create some online courses and you make three to five thousand dollars per month for many people that is a game changer you know it took me years to get my income level to where it is today it took me years when i first came on youtube i wasn't making this kind of money and you know i don't want to gas you up and be telling you that hey you know yeah you can do this and with six months you can be making ten thousand bucks and it's super easy and you don't have to work that hard i'm not going to gas you up like because you know my process is to tell you the truth and my process is to inform you and educate you on what works and what doesn't work. And this is something that I've done multiple times. I did it with Hustlers Kung Fu. I did it with Disruptive Mail. I did it with B-School for Hustlers. So this is a proven concept that I can teach you how to do it. And right now, this is an educational moment. I'm like, okay. You know, the way that I have this stuff set up, it works really well for warm traffic, but it doesn't work so well for cold traffic. That's more, that's information you need to know. That's information. And we're going to get into all of that when we get into the, how to make, how to create digital products for fun and profit. This is something I've been doing for 12 years, how to build a, a YouTube channel influence. I've been doing this for 12 years and I've been doing the LLC thing for 20 years and these are relatively new, but I'm really good at making ads so I can teach you how to do that. In the creative mind, of course, on creativity, this fits into the YouTube narrative and it fits into the YouTube creative. So this is what we're going to be doing. And we're about to have a good old time. We're about to have some fun. We're about to have some really good webinars. We're about to get into it. And we're going to set you up for how to make money because I feel that once I start running ads, this is going to convert because it's a better presentation. And as soon as they come in there, boom, it's YouTube. They know they're in the right place. There's no confusion. There's no fluff. There's no stuff that doesn't make any sense that I thought about this for quite some time when I was figuring out that it was my, um, creative it was my uh th my offer that was booty my offer was booty and you know I, I see this as being a great year for helping people learn how to do this youtube thing right at a higher level because i want you to think you start a youtube channel and like you know you get yourself three five thousand subscribers and then you put together a, a offering and you're making five thousand dollars a month plus what you make on your job that's, that's $60,000 a year, man. You know that 79% of the country doesn't make $60,000 a year. So you got your job. Let's say you make 30 and then you got your YouTube business. You're making 60. That's 90 G's. And then now you get a whole host of tax benefits and deductions. And you, you could, you could set up things to be super cool, super fun that will bring enjoyment to your life. But also put money in your pocket. How cool is that? So the, this is one of the things we're going to get into. So the links are below and we start 
tomorrow. Well, actually, I'm going to start moving some stuff tonight, but we're going to get into it. Give me about a good two weeks to get it kind of beefy. And tomorrow, what is tomorrow? Tomorrow is Tuesday. So I'm going to sit down and I'm going to spend the whole day on getting that um, how to create parent companies section. And, you know, I may shoot some new videos for that. Just depends once I get in there and dive in. But that's all I got for you guys. If you want to be part of this experience, the link is below. And I'm going to... I don't know if I even if you should do try to do both of these things because it's going to be a lot um, because I know I'm going to get people who are going to send me questions about what's the deal for getting both of them and I'm going to I don't know if I, I don't know how I'm going to do that I don't really know how I'm going to do that so that may be something that may come later or just send me a you know send me a question or leave a comment about both if i get enough comments about you know getting both then i will probably create something but right now i feel that these are two different distinct and separate tracks uh the people who signed up for the corporate toolbox are going to get both because you know i am pretty much changing the game up um doing something different so they're going you know the folks who got into the corporate toolbox way early are going to love this and yeah so that's where we are. Links are below. I will talk to you guys later. You have a good day.